the NASCOM Gaming Forum Awards happened and uh, well, I have one of the winners here for the Jury Choice Awards. Uh, care to introduce yourself, sir? Uh, my name is Anshumani Rudra. I work for uh, Tiny Mogul Games. And uh, yeah, we just won game of the year for our game Dadi vs Jellies. So yes, uh, that brings us to the second part. Dadi vs Jellies won the game of the year award by Jury Choice. And trust me, it's a wonderful game. It's humorous, but tell me one thing, why are we targeting Dadis here? Uh, I think our Dadis are probably the coolest people that we know, the most kick-ass people that we know. So we thought, uh, let's, uh, let's make a game to celebrate that. Okay, so could you give us like a brief reminisce about the game? Yeah. So, the game is pretty simple. Jellies are attacking Dadi's house and Dadi's kind of protecting her territory. Mm -hmm. So, Dadi's kind of made up this big badass gun from household parts. Uh -huh. And uh, so, it's a top down tower defense sort of game. Jellies are, are trying to invade Dadi's territory and Dadi's shooting them down. So, how did you strike, uh, strike upon this idea? It's, it was pretty simple actually. We just. Uh, there were a lot of games going around which had jellies as the main characters, you know, all these cute, cuddly jellies. Uh, and we were kind of fed up of games like that. So we said, you know, why don't we make jellies the enemies? Uh, and then somebody said, so who's who's targeting jellies, right? Because if the idea was that, yes, the jellies are villainous, but they're still cute. So how do you, you know, uptake the cuteness quotient from cute jellies? So he's like, the, the, so you, you know, like cute evil. yeah, cute evil. So we said, you know, who, who's going to be shooting down all these jellies? And uh, one of our artists was just drawing this old grandmother. Uh, and we said, you know, put a big gun in our hand. And the moment he put this big massive gun in Dadi's hand, it was like, and then we sh uh, we kind of, he drew some jellies running away from her. And that was it. I mean, we made the poster before we made the game. And once we made the poster, we just wrote Dadi versus jellies and that was set in stone. Intense, intense. So did the jury mention any specific uh, comments when you won the uh, award? No, any, any special thing they wanted to mention? No, nothing much. I mean, I think uh, the competition was tough. There were a lot of really good games nominated this year. Uh, so yeah, we are just happy that we won. So how does it feel now that you com like complete one major uh, milestone now? Yeah, sure. I mean, I, I feel really happy for my team. My team has put in a lot of hard work, a lot of effort into this game. Uh, and uh, I think this uh, it's a great time for our studio, a great time for our team that we won this award. Yeah. Good, good, good. So Anshumani, I shouldn't probably keep you because your face looks like sapped of blood. Considering you told me you've just come from Montreal and this guy's not stepped for 48 hours, that's the dedication you need to win awards here because this is the grandmother of all games and this game has just won the grandmother of all awards, is that right to say? So the grandmother of all gaming awards. Well, this is Anshumani here once again who's won the Game of the Year award by the jury choice in the NASCOM Gaming Forum Awards 2014.